Let's think about this. Where are my highest winning chances? What have I not played also? Okay, let's play knight f6. Let's play an early c5 this time. Queen b6 is saucy. Let's play like this. I haven't played like this yet. Yeah, well, this, I mean, this is terribly lukewarm. So let's play g6. Let's try to spice it up a little bit. This is, this is, this is very stable. This is just an exchange Karakhan now, basically. Let's just go bishop g7. I'm assuming he'll put his bishop here. Ah. There. Uh, what do I even play here? Weird position. Five? Not much I can think about here. Knight e4? What if I try to clarify the position quickly? That's a move. Let's take this. He's playing really fast as well. I don't... I don't like it. I don't like it. Can he slow down? I liked Eric Rosen before he was playing quickly. Still like him, but a bit less now. Play f6 and try to push for e5. Is that anything? Always looking to instigate is what we're trying to do. Always looking to instigate somehow. Uh, you could do a lot of different stuff. Like that, for example. Wait, can he do this? Can he just blunder? Just have e5 here, takes, takes, bishop takes, and then I have rook f3? Have that? That looks odd. But I think he just blundered. Take, 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 I have rook f4. If take, take, bishop takes, I have rook f3. Queen f3, knight e5. I don't think I'm like winning, but I think it's just gonna make for a very exciting middle game where I'll have two pieces. But I, I, I don't have a, I have no freaking clue if I'm better or not. Take, take, he's gonna take with the bishop. I don't think he has any options. Well, that, I mean, I guess he could play bishop g4. What? No, he can't play that. What the, f what? Rook f3? I guess this is just a different version of it. e4 takes ed3. I mean, what? This isn't some, no 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 this this can't be good. Queen d6, rook d8. Queen d7, rook queen d whatever, he's going to make that move over there, up there. I can't I don't know the coordinates. And then I'll play queen d6, h6, bishop h4, g5. Actually not just completely terrible for him. Rook f3, queen f3, queen g5 takes. Okay. Guess I have to do it. I, I don't know. I mean, I, it's very tough to tell there. Um, no idea. Okay, he's going to take with check. I'm going to play king h8. I have no idea if I'm better or worse. No idea. I don't like this, which just looks very straightforward. Rook f8, queen b7. Yeah, I don't know. Actually, here maybe he's just better. Maybe I should have just played queen d6. But too late. I made my bed. Now I've got to sleep in it. I don't know why I had to say that in a British way, but... e7. That's for all the people that say I, say I look like Harry Potter, so... Um, but he didn't play queen d7, so now... Now I think I'm 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 doing I'm doing okay. 
Doing okay. Rook d8. Yeah, if, if, yeah, if, uh, yeah, well, oh, no, 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 no. If somebody wins before 14, no, no, sorry. No, we will not play all 14. Um, I don't love chess that much. Queen c7, I like it enough, but not to that extent. So it's first to seven and a half, basically. It's first to seven and a half, yeah. I was close. I mean, what was it? It was 5-1. So he's, he's done quite well. I don't, I don't, I don't know what I'm supposed to, I don't know how I'm supposed to play this. No idea. Um, maybe I play rook d7 and go for a trick. That's my trick. I'm going, I'm, I'm going for knight d4. And I mean, if he blunders it, then, but I think he'll play rook e4 or king h1. I, I don't actually think, maybe, and my next move is rook e7. But the threat is knight d4. Not fall for my threat, and I don't have any more ideas. Six. The only way I can win this if is if I prevent counterplay completely and also shut down uh, and, and and coordinate my pieces in a good way. So, for example, if he plays f four, which actually now that I'm looking at it looks terribly annoying for that. Like I can't weaken my position too much, and doing that when there's this piece imbalance is just so difficult. Like I don't, I don't know how to do it. I don't know how to avoid making weaknesses. He's just going to push his pawn. It's always good to have a pawn majority in these kinds of positions. Okay, let's go knight e7. This is, this is, this is officially my reroute. That's me rerouting. You guys happy? I'm rerouting. And he immediately comes with a weakness. Queen c6. I think queen trade is winning for me. But again, I don't have a damn clue. Oh, he doesn't really have a choice, does he? Because a4. Well, he can play queen c2. But he's not going to play queen c2. Oh, that looks like an interesting move. But I, it comes with a tempo, but I'm not even sure it's a good tempo because I can't take because he has rookie eight. That's annoying. I try to glue it shut. Knight d6. I think he missed this move. Now I think I should be winning, but it's... Really? Ridiculous. Really ridiculous. <laughs> what? Take? I mean, he just blundered in time trouble there, I guess. Oh, knight f3! <gasps> I missed knight f3! Oh my god, I missed knight f3. Wow. All right, I'm going blind is what's happening here. I mean, just knight f3 was... Okay, he missed it anyway. <laughs> he missed knight f3 anyway. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. What a... Yeah, we're getting tired. Wow. We're getting tired. All that, all that hype. And uh, all right, I need one more point. We're getting tired is what's happening. Jesus. I don't know how we survived that. That that was that if he won that game, he might win the match, honestly, because he's within one, he's on a huge streak. I am not on momentum. Oh wow. 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 Just like sub battles, yes. All right. Draw and I win? No. You, your math is wrong. I, I don't win on a draw. It's six and a half, three and a half. Um, but... Crazy. Absolutely crazy. Just need the next game to start. And we will be good. Wow. All right. I guess we're catching our breath.
I guess we're catching our breath here is what's happening. Wow. One of us needs a, a quick break. Which course should you buy? You should buy the E4 course, definitely. Definitely buy the E4 course. No, okay, there we go. Super. No, 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 it's all good, it's all good. No worries, no wor- Hey, the, I, it's absolutely fine. I'm just, it's, it's good to take a break. Definitely a, a deserved break. Uh, I haven't played this yet. Let me play this. Chagorin style. Chagorin style. Uh, I don't know what to do now. I think I have six. Play F6. This is like complete crap, but... We'll see what we can do. We'll see what we can do. If I can win the match by playing f6 on move 3 and knight c6, the London has to be refuted. I mean, there is simply no way a, a human being can get away with playing like this against an opening that wants to be considered serious, right? So that's all I have to say. And best of luck to my opponent. And if I get completely obliterated for playing this, then I deserve it. So, but overall, I don't know. I mean, I'm striking back in the center. It doesn't strike me as entirely stupid. A little bit stupid, but, you know, you need stupidity in life. Like somebody, you have to rejoice in something, so. Um, and Chazzy is making a stew that I will promptly be sent after this triumphant victory of mine. Um... Wow, it took him a very long time to play that move. I was thinking to take, uh, but I, I really don't like the prospect of opening my position so early because I played like such a oaf early on. Play bishop b4 check. Okay, let me play bishop e6, and on knight c3 I'm just going to pin him. I need to go for quick development. That's the only way I can possibly offset what I've done in the opening. Um, if take, take, looks like nothing, so... Yeah, probably I just have to go for some sort of quick development. Otherwise, white will literally just be winning because of my weak king. But if he doesn't play this critically, meaning he doesn't, like, refute me, play aggressively, probably going to go 97 and be completely fine. So, but I, I like that he's taking his time. I like that. I really like that. So, again, if he, but he can also just play natural stuff and be also fine. Like, I don't know if me taking here was good. I... I, I <sighs> You're here? I thought about... Why did I think that he couldn't play that move? Was my plan to play e4? But e4 just looks so stupid. <laughs> why did I think that e4 was my salvation? Um, okay, but I'm, I, I'm, I have nothing else. I have to just be all in on this. But, uh, this is pretty terrible, I think. I think this is quite poor for me. Also, I hung a pawn, by the way. He can take on c7. He, he missed it, but he could have done that, and that would not have been pleasant. All right, so now I, I mean, my position, pos like, from a positional standpoint, my position does not make any sense. I have traded off my dark squared bishop, and I have only pawns on light squares. I'm basically playing this game like a complete degenerate. There's <laughs> no real sugarcoating of it. That's what's happening. But Eric has a minute, so if Eric doesn't... If Eric doesn't find a way, then I win the match, and the London is retired from, from, from existence, actually. Not even, I mean, just literally existence. Let me castle. So... Yeah, like, the, the, you can't play chess like this. The, the, this is very bad. Again, I, please don't, if you're watching this and you want to learn something, learn to not play the game like this. 
Okay. Just, if you're going to do that, just... I should have played queen d7. Queen d7 had very nasty intentions. Uh, but again, I like that he only has 50 seconds. c4, bishop c4, b5, he just takes. 7. The threat is knight d4. That's why I should have played this originally. Knight d4 is a brutal move. It is actually a brutal move. Uh, he, if he takes my queen, I take with check, I take with check, and I win. And I... Oh, he almost got me. <laughs> almost got me. That defense. Let's do it. Not. If he goes c4, he still hangs knight d4. Uh, takes. I like it. And then when he does this, oh, he does that. Oh, I didn't, I didn't realize Mr. Rosen was a gangster. That was, that, that should have been, I should have been notified of that prior to accepting my match against them, that Eric Rosen did not indeed, <laughs> indeed F around. All right, G4 though. Uh, but you know, he ain't no West Coast gangster, so. Also from the East Coast. I'm quoting Nate Diaz, all right? That's what I'm doing. That's what I'm doing. Rookie 8, here we go. He's only got 20 seconds. I can put him away. We can do this right now if we believe. Believe, conceive, achieve. Stop consolidating. Just let me win the game. Stop it. Stop it. If here, knight d4? Oh. I want to go here, but he's going to move here. Or that. Okay, now I'm going to... We're going to do some stuff. We're going to do some stuff, Mr. Rosen, you and me. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Maybe we won't be doing some stuff. I liked it back when there was at least some vague hope of that occurring. Okay, it looks like maybe I consolidated. Maybe. No promises again, but maybe. Maybe. But he's opening up another front of attack because he just, he just can't... He just can't get enough of me. I mean, the man just wants to defeat me so bad. And I respect that. I'm, I'm just... I'm saying complete gibberish. But please ignore me. Uh, but, but I need to talk. Otherwise, it would just be boring. Is he going to take? Oh, that's so positional. That is so positional. Take. Or how about here? What do we do? We go for counterplay? Well, wait a second. Rook e8, rook b7, h5, h4. I don't have a lot of time. This is it. I'm going for counterplay. This is it. May the best man win. Wait, I hung b7. That was a pretty bad job of getting counterplay. Why did I hang b7? That was so unnecessary. That was so bad. Why did I do that? You just ignore me. Wow. But he's just winning. Yeah, he's just winning here. <sighs> That's a bummer, because I actually thought I was making some progress in the game. I'm assuming he's winning?
What is happening? Wait. Who is winning and why? Rook b5? Takes, takes. I have no... I, I mean, I, I still think he's winning here, but... Yeah, he, he must still be playing for a win, I think. But so tough to tell. Mm, no, I think I just I just misplayed this completely. Yeah. Two versus one is uh <sighs> Maybe rook b5. Yeah, I rushed that. Alright, GG to Eric. Is that Hikaru? Shout out to Hikaru. Hope I didn't uh, ruin your appetite with that suboptimal game. What do we do here? A knight of six. I'm running out of lines. Like, I want to keep playing new stuff, but I... I don't know. What else is there? Okay, there, there's the professional variation. There's c5, bishop d6, and queen c7. So I'm going to go for that. So bishop d6 and queen c7. This is the super GM variation. Tham Tham, show some respect, you oaf. That was a great game. That was a very nice game from Eric. Um, I didn't blunder, right? This is like normal. I think you're supposed to go back. So I think black like takes. Looks weird, but I, but I think you do it. I just don't know if you do it like here. I'm gonna do it, whatever. Play h6. Yeah, I don't think I'm supposed to be afraid of this. If he kills me, he kills me. But he's, he's, I'm not too scared somehow. Um. <clears throat> Oh, wow. That is a move. Bishop d7? What? 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 Does he really want bishop? Does he want queen h4 and then g4, g5? Actually? Knight c6, queen h4. That just looks so bad. God. But I can't, I can't figure out what to do. It looks bad, but I can't figure out what to do. Maybe it's not bad at all. Okay, let's go here. No idea. Also, e4 is an idea. This queen a4 move is so freaking puzzling. I thought it was like terrible, but I don't have a way to. Let's go here. Let's do this. Okay, that is a move. I don't think it's a good one. Let's go bishop d7, so e5 can be met with takes. Actually, anything can be met with knight e5. Even ed5. Even if he takes, I go here, I take, I'm better. So, uh-huh, 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 uh-huh. Yeah, but isn't this, like, totally... Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, who's, who's gonna mate who, Eric Rosen? Who's gonna mate who, buddy? Yeah, hey, play this move. Got my face. Got my face with this fake checkmate bravado garbage. You trying to checkmate me? Ah, oh, 
Oh, rook c8. Okay, so he he's no longer interested in checkmating me. I do I, I do I do very much like that. Now the question is, what do I do with this central structure? Um, if I let him go, okay. If I let him go. Queen e2. And knight e5 takes takes bishop back. Yeah, I think maybe this might be the way. Right here, here, here. Uh, Chess is weird. I don't know. Oh, what do I do? Do I give in to temptation? Or do I just take back on d5? I think I'm gonna do it. I don't it just looks so nice. It's probably just not good, but I mean how do I how do I not play this? How do I not play this? Like this? That's pretty straightforward, I suppose. <laughs> um, thought I had something. I mean, I probably do have something. I probably just get some sort of dry counterplay and slowly die a boring death. But, I mean, bishop b5, he just says c4. Okay, so let me just take this. Um, bishop c6 doesn't Cut it. Bishop h3. Bishop e6. Well, I guess I just I thought I had more than I'm getting, is, is, is the best way to describe it. Let's just play rook d8. That's it. I just, I thought I was just getting more than this. I'm up a pawn. I mean, I'm sorry, down a pawn. But... I have some I have some hopes. It's not not lost, I don't think. Bishop h3. Queen c6. Queen a7, I just take the pawn. Plunder. F4, bishop h3. Not there's nothing like there's nothing that just I'm gonna go back so he can't move his knight. I, I just had to play a fast move. Just had to play a fast. I don't know if that's. The, I don't I have no idea if that's what I did was best, but whatever. Sometimes you just need to move quickly, and I, and the good thing is this knight can't move, and that that just looks. How does how does someone not get? No idea what I'm supposed to play. All right, let's play this move. Let's go. Actually, I think the move that I just played is very strong. It was like unexpectedly very strong. Please play Rook here. That would be very nice. That would just end the game. That would just that would end the game in the match. Please, Eric, just play Rook D3. Just just for me. Do it for me. What? All right. I feel like some sort of progress is potentially being made. Oh, that's a that's a tough move. Somehow, I got nothing. After all that, nothing. I don't know how, but I didn't get a damn thing. A 
It's tough. That is pretty crazy, I'm not gonna lie. I expected to get something from the position. Oh man, nothing was definitely not an expect- Oh, fucking, I, bl I blundered. Ah, uh, pain. It's all I feel. Oof. Yeah, wow, that sucks. All right, one game lead. Got to draw two games or I got to win one. Here we go. What do we play when we need to win? That is exquisite, I have to tell you. Wow. That is really something. Okay, what if I just take and go knight f6? Um, is he gonna play f3? Wow. Well, you gotta respect the fighting spirit. Brood with Modelo, by the way. Wow. I guess he's going to castle long. I guess I'll try to play this move. Or this move. H6 or knight d7? Let's go h6. Let's, let's try to... I mean, I guess he's going to hang around because he, he really wants to make this move work. He's got to make this move work. If he wants anything in the position. And I also have e5. Kind of whatever I want. Okay. I think he just goes straight for it. No, but this is terrible for white. In terms of like. Winning chances. I mean. This is like really. From my, my understanding of the game of chess. I don't. Go a6 so he can never play knight b5. E5, I guess there's always this move. So maybe it's the C pawn push that we go for. Um, C5. I'll bring the queen out here. I'm suddenly far more focused and a lot less happy, which is basically how chess works. Can I play queen f2? I hate this move. I, I, think, I think it's a terrible move, but I, I, I just... Like, now that he doesn't have knight d5... Now that he doesn't have knight d5, I like e5 a lot more. Okay. Appreciate it. I'm 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 f I'm feeling the power. All right, Eric. Keep on thinking, buddy. Keep on thinking. I'll take the forty second time advantage. I will take it. I got e four here. That's what I thought I was gonna do. G six also keeps the tension. E four, f four also. F four looks dumb. F4 looks dumb. For D. 
I don't like this move, but I don't really have a lot of time, so let's go. Then maybe I'll take and just put my rook on e8. Whoops, I'm not going to eat my own knight. Queen f2 with the threat of what exactly? If I just play here, here, wait. f4, he takes, takes, knight e4, takes, takes. Rook e8, keeping the tension. That's what we're doing here, keeping the tension. Maybe he'll crack under the pressure. Or will crack under the pressure. Um, I'm going to take on d4. I don't know if this is right. I don't know if this is right. It's f4. Be queen f4 here. Be queen e7. Maybe queen f4. Let's go queen f. I, ju I just can't figure it out. So I just can't figure it out. And I don't want to get hit with some stupid tactic that I overlooked because of nerves and time trouble. I like the big time advantage. All right, knight f6, knight e2. Got like some weird way of coordinating his pieces here. All right, let's go here. Rook e2, I thought was eight for him, but I don't see why it's not great. <laughs> so, oh, I have knight g4. Rook e2, knight g4 is very interesting. Wow. Doesn't, I don't think it wins anything, but it, it's just very cool. Knight g4. Just goes queen g1, though. How is, how is it that I have nothing there? Knight g4, queen g1? Really? Not, a, not any move that does anything. How does that happen? All right, let's go c5. I have to open up another front. So this is me opening up that other front. Might be a little bit too dangerous. But I don't see it. So this is me trying to win the game. Alright. C4 is weak. All my pieces are better positioned than his. I have one weakness in the position that is very obvious. His king has no entrance squares. I'm just going to play knight d6. Five. How do I... Just take this into an endgame with king f6? <sighs> b5 and c4? Take a6, take d3. Take, take, take. All right, I'm just going to go here and here. I just don't see it. I don't see the I don't see the way to win this. Oh, I had a nice position, but CSH. Okay. A four looks nice. G five also looks nice. A lot of stuff looks nice. I play f4. Take. I'm winning. I don't know how that happened. But out of nowhere, I am winning. Did I just allow...
Outside pass pawn. Here we go. Outside pass pawn. Consolidate a4. Consolidate and a4. Also, knight e6 should be a win. If he takes. I think it's a win. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Wow. The tricks in this man's bag. That is so ridiculous. How <laughs> for me to screw that up? Wow. <gasps> wait. Did I have it there? Wait, 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 wait. Oh, that is, that's brutal. What a save. Oh my god, I completely forgot about that. Damn. Well, it comes down to the final game. <laughs> what to say? Oh, that's, that's crazy. Wow. That was so winning. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. The corner trick. Alright. Draw wins me the match. Draw wins me the match. He has to win. He's going to look to create some craziness on the board, and I'm going to try to stabilize. Expect something like this. Soki Koro says something about throwing something out the window. I, I, I expect that that something is very well out the window at this point. Uh, uh, man. Dude, the one trick that he had. I was, it was over. The match was, it was over right there. Like, it was actually just done. So, um, that sucks. Recovering from that is going to be uh, difficult, not going to lie. But Eric has to play for a win, and um, okay. Go knight c six. I mean, if he plays g five, th th this is this is very much I feel as outside outside his style. So, I probably have some advantage, but, I mean, he's played inc just incredibly resourcefully after falling behind early, so I can't really sit here and say anything, frankly. Go queen b6. I, I mean, I have no idea if this is any good, so we're just gonna, we're gonna have to do our best. It's like a very odd French, kind of. Should be seven castles. Very odd position. I think he's just obviously worse, but it's blitz, so doesn't really matter. Let's go castles. I think if I if I play something like this, looking to trade his bishop. Hmm. Rook c8 with ideas to take this guy. Play knight a5. Again, I, I'm I'm very unafraid of the move g5, because if I just come back, same side castling position, attacking me is most likely just impossible. Um, it's most likely just impossible. So he plays knight d1, that is a very interesting move. I'm gonna take, I don't really, I don't have the emotional capacity to, to analyze the position that much right now, so. <laughs> being completely honest. That's a free pawn. I don't know if he's going to give it to me, but he could, I mean, just for Gambit-style play. But this is really the idea, so. Alright, I like his time expenditure, although him playing in time trouble hasn't really affected anything much. People are telling him in his chat that he missed bit G5 trapping my knight. 
Why are people telling him moves that are so terrible and not true at all? Do they want him not to win? It's just so strange. Like, not, none of that is accurate. Very odd. Alright, Queen B8. My queen has joined the party. Really want to play this, but I don't think it does anything. I think I'll play, I'll, play, I'll play the knight this way. That looks like a headache move. I don't know if it is, but it's certainly... Did he just hang an exchange? He just hung an exchange! But it's like still not easy. It's still somehow like some, in some stupid way not that straightforward, even though I'm up at night for rook. I almost wish I went to c4, because that rook was garbage. But, whatever. I'll take my material advantage, I suppose. So I think the plan right now is... I don't know what the plan is, actually. Yeah, like, this is so odd. Take, take... All right, let's go queen b6. Because I want to play knight c7 and rook e8, but I, just, I can't play that right now. The other thing that he can play is knight to c5, which is inconvenient, but then I'll play e5 myself. So I think he should take... Well, actually, I'm not going to say anything. Why would I give him any moves? What? I don't think that's where his pieces belong. Yeah, I don't like that at all, because now I can play knight c7, or queen d6 even first. Queen d6, then knight c7. And f4 doesn't... Yeah, I don't think this is... I don't think this is how he's supposed to do it. What the hell do I know about chess, though? Rook here and bishop c8. So we're going to defend. We're just up in exchange. We're going to defend. And maybe try to play e5. Thought I had knight a6 here. Do I have knight a6 here? Is he gonna play b4? Take, 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 take. Everybody take something. Okay, let's take it then. Which way does he take? Does he take with a b pawn? He does take with a b. Almost feels like I want to do this. Give me e... F no, he didn't give me... God damn it. e5, bishop b5, ef4, queen e8, rook e8, takes, 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 king f7, and like, who is better there? Do I go for that? I have this e5 move, but I just... Now I'm going to go for it. I think this could be good now. Now do I take on g4? No, I think I take like this first, because if he plays f5, I go e4, and I'm just winning. Takes. Take on g4 have some big ideas here. Rook f3 is also playable. Check. Queen c5, queen f2 I have. Also queen e7 here. And bishop e4, maybe, also. Bishop e4 takes, bishop takes, rook e5, bishop h7. Just 
Just be extra solid. That was not extra solid. That was not extra solid. God. Just hung this pawn. Crazy. The nerves actually got to me there. Nuts. Oh my god. I can't believe it. Oh, I had bishop b5. I had bishop b5, but this is good enough. Wow! Oh my goodness! I don't even feel like... I don't even feel... I don't... I don't, I don't even feel like I won the match. Oh my god. Oh my god, that was insane. Jesus. What a match. <laughs> that is the last thing that I expected. Um Wow. That, yeah. Okay, Eric's gonna reconnect now. Um... That's crazy. Okay, he's rejoining. Oh, we can wait for the celebration for after. I think he and I are just going to chat for a, for a few minutes. We, I, don't, I, I highly doubt we're going to analyze. But, uh, I mean, we were thinking to analyze it. But, I mean, that literally came down to the last game. Like, seven and a half, six and a half. We pull it off. I mean, wow. Is that the end for the Londons? I, 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 no, I, I really don't think so. I don't think that's the end. But I hope those games entertained you, people. Um, I wish I could have, um... Eric's joining, one sec. Hello. Hey, Eric. Hey, nice match. <laughs> one that sec. Was, was topsy turvy. Yeah, uh, one sec. I'm just, I'm pulling. Okay. Oh, dude, I feel like I just, like, had the longest blood draw of my life. Me too. Yeah, well. At least in the beginning, I felt like I was just dying game after game after game. And then somehow, I don't know, you you revitalized me. And then <laughs> and this finish was was a bit crazy. It was uh it, it was it was the game where I hung the rook. Queen A6 B5. That was Oh yeah. 
I was because I, I felt like I was I was pressuring. That's right. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I momentum was like, shifted for sure. Uh, we had some plans to analyze positions. I don't, <laughs> I don't know if that's still the plan. Yeah, um, like this this was like exhausting. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I'm completely okay letting letting people in the future YouTube comments uh, spit out their analysis and. Um, I mean, there's so many moments, but I think overall, the like, the, all the games were determined much later beyond the opening. Yes, yes. Uh, like, people in my chat are like, is this the end of the London system? I'm like, well, <laughs> considering I came literally to the borderline of losing this match, probably not. Also, I thought I mixed it up. I think I played a different setup every yeah. game. Which I was, was running impressive. I was running out of options. Like some had little F five moves, some had G six, but um, yeah, even early on, like I wasn't getting dominant positions from the opening or anything like that. I mean, it was just games and that. Yeah, I mean, I, I think like all all the openings were and they just led to fights. I don't know. I'll probably go back. Like this is probably a very good, uh, I guess, learning experience to to delve into theory a bit more deeply and and to find like i was trying to play some tricky ideas um that are, are maybe a, a bit more offbeat and and some lines i actually prepared beforehand with uh with the engine but not not too uh -oh. nothing too specific uh oh <laughs> yeah i was very perplexed but you had a very early knight c3 and i had to play bishop mm -hmm. before and then you greek gifted me and somehow i didn't lose um yeah I actually don't know if the, like if that was objectively the best option. It was wild though. It's, it's like one thing to analyze. Yeah. When we have more energy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I like a lot of stuff is happening in the background in my apartment as well. Like I, I mm -hmm. was like supposed to end. Well, I wasn't supposed to end. But there was a very legitimate chance this could have gone three hours, and I I was just like ah. really hoping that. But, it did and now we're here. So. <laughs>